hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Rachel and this is my horse Willow. So I thought I would start by doing a little bit of introduction about myself and Willow so you can get a bit of an idea about who we are and what we do. I'm 26 years old and I live in New South Wales, Australia. Willow is turning nine this year and she was born in 2011. We've been together for four years. We first met when she was one. That was obviously eight years ago. So I was 19 and I was in uni studying and yeah, I met a wonderful lady who owned about 12 horses and one of them was Willow. So obviously there's a bit of a gap from when I first met Willow to when I started owning her, which is only four years ago. So during that time I was studying at uni, I was learning how to ride horses, I was learning how to care for horses and everything in between. And I was riding her half brother for a while while she was sold for two years. No one rode her during the time she was sold. They saw her running around the paddock like crazy and were too nervous to get on her, which is good for me because it meant that I got to have her as a blank slate by the time she came back and was in my hands. Willow and I started our journey together in 2016. She had just come back from the people who she was sold to, back to the people who bred her. I'd always loved Willow since she was a foal because she was always such a cuddly and people person. People whore? She just really loved people and I love that too. And that was always a big draw card to her. Just a beautiful, really nice, friendly personality. It took me a few years to build up my confidence in myself, in my own riding, in how I can look after a horse. So once I had all the basics, which is what I always wanted from a young age, I always wanted a horse. I knew, I always knew I would have one one day, but I didn't just want to dive in and get one because what do you do when you get a horse? How do you know what to feed it? How do you know what to do? How do you know anything? I didn't know anything about their body language. I didn't know anything about riding. I didn't know anything about feed. All that fun stuff. So it took me a while until I did get Willow, but honestly, I feel like that wait was 100% worth it and I'll do it all again just so I can have her in my life. So yeah, we started riding and as you might have noticed, we ride in a halter. It's just because the people who bred her, that's how they train their horses up as well. I started Willow the same way and she has to this day still never had a bit in her mouth and honestly, I don't see her ever having one in. So it was only like 2015, 2016 that I really started actually getting lessons and learning how how to care for a horse, how to ride for a, ride a horse and all that. I just feel like because of all that time that I've known her for since a fall, that it kind of brought us more closer and more in tune with each other. I can walk out my door and I can see Willow. My whole life I feel has been building to be with her. As corny as that sounds, I don't care. The I bond like that with a horse is something else. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> I'm gonna stop being corny now and show you some videos, bye. 